Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Food Lover Asian. With me, it's all about food and traveling. And you can also follow me on Instagram under the same name, Food Lover Asian. Well, in this video, I am here at SeaTac, Seattle Tacoma International Airport in Seattle, Washington. The big question is layover in Seattle Airport. What are you gonna do? Do you wanna be stuck inside the airport and eating Seattle restaurant food? Well, could be, but I wanna show you how easy it is to get out of Seattle using, you can use Uber or public transportation. Either way, your choice, I can show you both in this video and also what kind of food and also things to see. You know what? Let's just get going. Don't waste time, let's go. So finding your way out of the airport can be a little tricky, but let's start now. We are going down to the baggage claim since that's where you're most likely to go first. The first option, I'm going to show you the right share route. Look for signs saying ground transportation. This will lead you towards the parking garage. And once you're outside, you want to look and follow the sign says app base right chairs on top basically just follow the signs all the way to the parking garage area until you see this big sign on the wall says the right share second option which is using the link light rail when we start from the baggage claim we will see the sign of ground transportation and look until the last number which is number 16 then we will need to go up the escalator so we can go through the bridge which will lead out towards the parking garage once we are outside look at the sign for link light rail turn to the left until you see the main entrance to the station it is quite a walk about eight minutes or so to get to the station and i'm going to need a ticket to ride the train you want to turn to the right and then the ticket booth is located right behind this big white pillar. So look at this. Yep, right there. I'm getting the ticket and I need to choose a destination. And I'm going to Westfield South Center Mall. So I'm choosing Tokwila International Boulevard Station. The train comes every 10 to 15 minutes. Very easy and convenient. And look at this. It's very spacious too inside. We are just one stop away from the Tequila International Boulevard station. And also, just follow the sign all the way down via escalator or the elevator because we are going to catch a bus going to the mall. Now that we are here at the bus station, we will look for Rapid Ride F Line from Tequila International Boulevard Link Station to Westfield South Center Mall. The good thing is that the F-Line and the bus number 128 both goes to the mall. Woohoo! So we don't need to worry about missing the bus. All the new buses has air conditioning and free Wi-Fi and that is great. If you pay the fare with cash, make sure to have the exact amount because the driver do not carry change. Always, always ask for the paper transfer as the proof of payment and uh, transfer good for two hour period. Okay, now that we are arrived here in Westfield South Center Mall, let's have the fun begin. You know, honestly, with so many choices of food and places to eat, I'm not sure where to start first. You know me, I love food. So why don't we just start with this mochi nut? And who doesn't like mochi and donut together? And they are sweet, just a perfect combo. And I also got this Korean corn dogs. And as you can tell, I look super happy. And they have my favorite flavor. Yes, Flaming Hot Cheetos. Whew. They just know that and can read my mind that I miss my Cheetos. Yes, and look at this cheese pool. It's never ending going and going and going and going yes isn't it satisfying i love it so much and it is <clears throat> so much fun to eat guess i will have to try this sushi burrito it is fun though watching them making the food 
Well, they look cute, but unfortunately, it is a little bit bland for my taste. Maybe I need more sauces next time. So I walk a little bit across the hallway to Popeyes. Yes, I love me some Popeyes, especially their chicken sandwiches. I got one fish, one chicken, both spicy. You know, this is just a simple sandwich. Just the meat, the protein, and also two slices of pickles with their sauces. And that just makes me happy. Does it make me a simple guy? Yes, I guess so. I know it is just a fast food, but I cannot get enough of this. Yes, love it, love it, love it. And also, I cannot to choose between fish or chicken. So, may as well just eat them both at the same time. Why not? Well, I did some walk around the shops and stumble upon this place, Somi Somi. Oh, I love this place. Look at this fish-shaped cones. I'm getting this creamy soft serve ice cream as the base. I chose Ube Matcha Mix Swirl. I chose this red bean filling and they are very generous. Now I have to choose the toppings. Gotta have some breakfast pebbles for the crunchiness and makes it more fun to eat. I like everything pretty especially for the presentation. It is time for me to eat it. I need some sweets. The soft serve is so good and creamy, just melts in your mouth. Okay, it is lunch time and it's time to eat. I had to wait a little bit to get into Din Tai Fung. Yes, I know, I'm preparing this with vinegar and soy sauce and I'm ordering everything that I have on the menu. Yes, yeah, Xiaolong Bao with this chili sauce. Mmm, it is so good. I have to have everything that I want to, so... And you know the best part is, when you eat this Xiaolong Bao, it pops in your mouth. Mmm, the best. I walk around some more after my lunch. Oh, they have a library here and a supermarket, Seafood City. They have restaurant and bakery too inside. It is nice that it's available here. They do have more stuff around here. So I settled with Chowking to get their Halo Halo. It is a Filipino dessert. You have to mix them all together. So all the flavors blend in, so refreshing. Okay guys, that's a wrap. That's my layover in Seattle. I pretty much eat a lot and also did a little shopping here and there. So now time for me to go back to the airport. Same way, what you want is go across the mall. They should have the station. Going back to the uh, Tequila Boulevard International Station and hop in the light rail to the airport. And voila, that's about it. So if you have not, please subscribe to my channel and also give me a big thumbs up and leave the comment down below. Until the next time. Sampai jumpa lagi. Bye.